Hello, we're here with Mr. Rao from the, he's the Secretary of Tourism for Kerala, uh, one of the most uh, beautiful states in the south. Uh, Mr. Rao, can you tell us what your plans are for 2015 and, and why you're here at the show? Oh yes, uh, plans are going to be very promising and uh, very uh, realistic. Um, whatever uh, we have planned so far, we are just trying to stand in them and come out with a new plan. Uh, that is uh, 2015 we have declared as Visit Kerala Year. Now this year uh, we are going to give a special impetus on our uh, propaganda and the publicity and our promotional campaign is going to be very strong. Uh, the two, pro two uh, strategies we have adopted uh, that is strengthening the existing markets and also looking for the new markets. The new destinations will be um, considered and these promotional activities will be concentrated on the new destinations. Now, if you see the last year um, inbound tourism uh, in Kerala, the foreign tourists, almost all 1 million tourists have visited Kerala and 55% of them are from Europe alone and uh, 10 to 15% are from USA. Uh, 10 to 12 percent are from Middle East and the rest are from um, China, Tokyo, Japan, uh, Japan and uh, uh, Korea uh, and Far East places. But we would like to concentrate more on uh, China, Japan and the Korean uh, countries uh, because we have uh, Ayurveda and wellness tourism which we would like to take out to the, take out, take, take up to the next level. Yeah. Okay, interesting. You say that uh, the idea is to strengthen on your on your on your strong points, um, could you describe what the strong points are of Kerala? Uh, strong points, yeah, it's a very uh, very comprehensive uh, travel package one can offer to uh, in, in any tourist here because you have wonderful uh, beaches, you have uh, uh, amazing backwaters, uh, you have wildlife sanctuaries, your forests, your hill stations. You know, within a span of uh, 700 kilometers, uh, Kerala is going to offer uh, the tourist. Um, uh, multi destinations, you know, this, this, uh, uh, plenty, a number of destinations are more, and um, uh, these trends we would like to uh, really focus. Uh, we would like to uh, come come out with the new infrastructure facilities, come out with new hotels, um, uh, and, uh, and and uh, come out with new new master plans and finding out uh, fresh destinations and show to the tourists in a big way. Okay. Um I hear there's some very interesting cities in uh, the area, including one in the south which holds uh, International Festival of Feed. Um, can you tell us about the food in the area of Kerala? How is it different to the rest of the rest uh, of the country? Oh yeah, definitely. You know, it's got uh, see, international accessibility is there. Kerala is one place which is uh, has access from everywhere. Uh, it, it is uh, almost all in the middle of the globe. It has got three international airports: Trivandrum, uh, Cochin, and Calicut. Uh, and um, uh, road connectivity is uh, uh, very nice and uh, highways are good, you have uh, um, uh, many flights coming from Middle East and the European countries and um, uh, the infrastructure facilities are improving uh, every day. Wow. And what are you looking forward to uh, experiencing in your own region in the next year or so? Well, next year I anticipate not to uh, develop in, uh, in, uh, in wellness tourism, Ayurveda, uh, because many of the people, mostly from the Middle East and uh, Europe, they would like to come and stay uh, for longer uh, durations. Um, last 3-4 uh, years we have been noticing that this development, that uh, tourists are coming and trying to prefer uh, to stay there for more than 2-3 uh, to three weeks. This is basically to undergo uh, medical, to medical uh, uh, treatments and so the medical tourism is really getting promoted in a big way and Ayurveda is our asset. Yes, well, it's very famous for this kind of thing. And, and Mr. Rao, thank you very much for giving us your time here today at ITB. And we wish you a very successful show. And um, see you again in the future, I hope. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you.